who's streaking right now. Back-to-back 20-point -back games. Big game for the Hawkeyes as Northwestern goes for win number 12 in the Big Ten. And the Cats control the tap. Through with the opening miss, but gets it back. It's Bowie. Putting down a three. And led by Perkins, Sanford, and Freeman. Here's Sanford with the first shot. And that goes down. You have to stay connected. You cannot lose it. Well, Blake Smith knocks that down. The walk this year, because of the Barry and Langborg injuries, he's now a starter. And the Cats will get it back. High, the miss is ricocheted to Bowie. And Smith off the shot fake into the body of Freeman. Playing with some confidence. Had a triple-double, the first in Iowa men's basketball history. And he has another three up and six points on the board. It's the free throw line, but it's helped. And Nicholson in a crowd. Martinelli through the back door. Trying to figure out how to wall up without fouling. There's Bowie snaking in. Freeman and Dix from Michigan State. And now they've got some opportunities with this game. And then one coming up to finish the season. And Perkins the drive. Nicholson. Well, they're plus four in rebounding margin since Ty Berry got hurt. Martinelli thuds it. Second look at it, though. It's Dix. Lining in the three. Yes, it's going to be fascinating to watch this transition defense for the Cats. Man, Sanford falling away with eight already. He was able to get his wide open shot. Well, Freeman blocks Bowie, who sticks with it and turns it over. Almost. The Northwestern has been playing some really good basketball of late, so there's a lot of moments to it. With Iowa up by four after the three-point play for Freeman. Here's Martinelli with the hook, and Freeman stabs that. Freeman. Well, Martinelli looked like he had a shot to go intercept that. And, well, this is a shorthanded Northwestern offense. They need every point they can get on offense, and Perkins pulls like Iowa did there for the drop-off. It's wide open there. Two three-point plays on this run. Freeman had the other one. A good defense from Dix, but Bowie stays with it. He really is, and you look at Bowie does everything for this team. Perkins strains the three. You know, they have a bunch of mid-range killers on this team. Get to the free throw line, too. Where's Barnheiser banging in, working on Barnheiser. Perkins can't get that three up. Sanford does. And Iowa finally misses. Since the turn of the century, it's been left out of the NCAA tournament field with that amount of wins in the Big Ten. It also helps. They want to leave no doubt. Well, Plenty motivated. And with all the injuries, they've still answered the question. So to, for, to sit here and say no in there, right? Like, you have a lot in front of you. You get that double bye. Now, all of a sudden, you set yourself up for a great run in the Big Ten tournament. Back to back here in the Big Ten. In conference games, Northwestern. And there's an outside hit for two for McCaffrey. Yeah. A little over 50 guys at Iowa have gone over 53 guys. There's Nicholson with a slam. Prone to get into a game like this. And the Harding, no look pass. Price Sanford in and out on the three. Rebound. Well, you love watching this guy pass. It's Harding on the take this time, and he scores it. Well, that's that trick. Basketball in Illinois, the head coach for Northwestern. Late in the clock, little high-low Nicholson to Barnheiser. Barnheiser almost and saved, and the Cats come away with it. Barnheiser rewarded for that hustle underneath. Be a long day for you. And it better never be a straight line. Paint and then building out. Build your foundation, then renovate. Absolutely. Here's for the Cats. Unavailable again. Cross-court hunger. Smith got backed up a little bit and had to be taught as Bowie goes down. Sanford air ball with that defense off the ball. Well, I think you're always correcting that because it's all about spacing, KYP, knowing your personnel. You got to learn quick. And he has in back to back starts. Forced to give up Harding. Long in the. You know, larger stretch of a 16 4 spurt for the Cats. Well, no look for the damn jam. And then two fouls for Hunger. Preston getting some run here. Drive and kick Dix. That's about as open as you can be. Brooks, Brooks. Sanford influenced the give up. Well, Bowie was letting that fire. Preston backs in and he can't get through it through the goal. 
Preston from outside shooting threes that pulled off a little bit to their mid-range specialty. He's a machine. Iowa has influenced Bowie to make a decision mid-air. And Dix cashes in. That's the no surprise with the way Josh Dix is playing right now. No, offensively he can do everything, but I would I love what he does on the defensive end. Out of the under four timeout. Sanford, quick fire, and got another. His third three of the half to force the timeout. Well, it all comes in transition. As you know, you have to find shooters in transition. Well, Martinelli has so many tools. You know, one of the two guys starting because of injury, Martinelli and Smith, because of Langbord and Barry out. There's Freeman. He had been to Blaustein and our camera crew. Getting that to you in slow-mo, too. Here's Martinelli, who's inbounds, and he's fouled. To score there, Iowa came. There's a big space right in the middle of the floor. Cut to the sun to hurt jerk because that's kind of the way he plays, right? You don't know where to go, and now he's creating angles. When he's creating angles, pigs do because they're slow-footed and they're behind. Dix, that's swallowed up. Tricky's followed. Well, good defense from Perkins. Had to recover, and Martinelli finds a soft spot. That middle is where he has carved out a ton of his points. Lefty for lefty and tricky high off. Does help the flow of your offense. There is just, they went with the ball screen. Because he was the last screener, Tony's able to get the ball on the ultimate analytics team versus somewhat anti analytics team. I know Iowa would be all for that because it would mean they're be involved with everything. You know that, but how does it happen and when does it happen? Well, a foul on Peyton Sanford, one of the last four teams out, and Mike DeCourcy's latest bracket. And that's a turnover. And I just said, oh, Barnheiser jarred that free. Well, Freeman turned his back and didn't realize the double team was coming. Good pass. Martinelli can't put it down. Dickens on Bowie. And Smith checking Sanford. It's a Dix three. And he drains it again. Uh, down to five to shoot. Barnheiser grinding in. Falling away. No. Smith offensive rebound. And he's to win under Chris Collins. Now, I know there's an NCAA tournament win. I know that. We asked Coach about that. Another career high today, like at Maryland. Seven points for Smith. Dembele, nice little turner. You can see all the freshmen growing. You can see every player five take that next step throughout the season. You don't see that with every team. Oh, tough. Iowa wasted no time. Same spot, Dix. Another one. His sub has the rebound. Oh, Bowie cradled it. A very clean game. A rare time where I was at single digits on the shot clock and Cricky's all limping off for the Cats. Martinelli out deep. Games ago. Chris Collins said that he's getting close. They added pressure on Bowie and Barnheiser, the two regular starters, getting some help from Martinelli again. A career high 27 for Martinelli last game. He's up to eight today. And lefty for lefty again. It's been Cricky. Andrews. And it's got to be Boo. He's got to find a way to take over. And good ball movement. Barnheiser at three. But it's so Luke Hunger was just trying to prove chest to chest with Cricky. And Cricky got three and rattles it down. Barnheiser, Bowie, and Martinelli have carried it. And it's Bowie straight to the rim. And Boo just with a mismatch. Well, Hunger hung with him. Of course, Dix to take it. He's fouled. And we'll. Here comes Perkins downhill. Sanford. Transition three. Clayton triple. And Iowa a chance. Now 10 on the shot clock. Perkins has a matchup on a big again. This time all the way in and Perkins wins it on press. His confidence continues to get more and more. And, and I was needing them. We, we know what's at stake. This team just keeps getting blows, and now we'll see what they do to answer that. And since Nicholson went out, a third regular starter, it's an 18 to 9. That much tighter on this end. Don't give up easy buckets. Make Iowa work for it. That's a tough shot. Stay in a game without all these guys? Yes. I, there's no reason I have. I, I could say no because they. If they can come back, it would be another one that's right up there. And Sanford rolls it off. And Bowie on Dix draws a big crowd. And Smith, Iowa wanted to travel. Bowie, triple. Yes, sir! 
16 and 1 overall, 8 0 in the Big Ten. Oh man, another great draw up from Kern. Iowa has gone dry from the field. Perkins gets him going. He gave it up to Barnheiser. And he's headed to the free throw line. Freeman spins. And good hands from Smith. Knocks it out. Collins would be upset because live I thought the same thing. Fall away. Dix. Heavy. Freeman. And Dix quiets the uh -huh. You too? Yeah, occasionally. Barnheiser the answer. Just a common foul on Barnheiser, his first. And the first to two at the line for Kirky. Out of that pile, too. Getting the stop out of his zone. Now Freeman coasts to the rim. That's that way long. Uh, Sanford zigging, zagging all the way home. Heavy towards Boo. Forced to give up Barnheiser. Corner pocket long. Dix with six. Down to five. Smith right with him. Dix slides it off. Boo. Iowa 6 0 run. Drive and kick. Martinelli stops the drops. Half court. Last few trips. Hedge from Preston. Now scrambling. Help from Martinelli. Freeman scores on first one down earns the second it's been a low foul game for Iowa and a turnover out of the pack Smith slams it down for the Cats Bowie answers it back the next one but there's some called social media and everything else out there they, these players know what's going on teams Around Iowa on the bubble. Perkins gives it up. McCaffrey. Oh, a heartbreaking. And Bowie puts it down to keep Northwestern in touch. The worst free throw shooter. Best free throw shooter in the Big Ten percentage wise. And two more big ones helping their case. But getting dire late, down seven. And Martinelli scores quickly. Clock running out. Tricky finishes it for the Hawkeyes. On the road at Northwestern.